The Benue State Government officials and delegation from the International Fund for Agricultural Development arrive at Daudu to meet with one of the many cluster farmer groups amidst celebration on dance. <laughs> For many years, farm produce like yam, cassava and rice, as well as mangoes, tomatoes and oranges, largely grown in abundance in Benue State, are largely wasted, hence the need to construct an aggregation center in Daudu. We believe that with this support, uh, most of the losses our off-takers incurred are the result of absence of uh, storage facilities will be addressed there. One of the young female farmers talks about her growth in the sector with mechanized farming equipment. With Hyper International, I got a, a tractor. They finance Hello Tractors Nigeria and to support farmers with a mechanized farming and I got a tractor with a Hello Tractor Nigeria. Done with the activities here, the delegation moved to the government house for a meeting with Governor Hyacinth Alia. The conversation centered around policy formulation issues, including funding and infrastructure support services to rural farmers. Through the Commodity Alliance Forum, farmers have been able to sell for about 17 billion naira over the seven years. So this is important income. You are adamant about reducing post-harvest loss, and this is key in the VCDP agenda, in line also with the national priorities. Governor Alia makes a commitment to funding and provision of critical infrastructure. By establishing rural infrastructure, such as accessible road networks, storage facilities, and market link linkages. We're creating an enabling environment that connects our farmers to profitable markets. Benue State, under my leadership, will continue to be committed to partnering with development organizations across the globe to upscale and expand the gains of the VCDP to even more beneficiaries. The dedication of the Benue State government under Governor Alia's administration to collaborate with development partners for assistance in bolstering the state's economy, if fruitful, should be evident in significant progress in vital sectors such as agriculture, healthcare, and infrastructure development.